How's it going, my lovely Death Disciples? I am the Shadow Reaper, and today we're going to continue our Dragon Age Inquisition Let's Play. Where last we left off, we had traveled to the Storm Coast, defeated some Red Templars, and also managed to come across a dragon, which no, I did not quite defeat it quite yet. Uh, but, uh, actually, that's, that's kind of it. Uh, we fought a dragon, died a lot, and uh, that we just, we, we died, and that all that stuff. Uh, so that's not going to be the dragon we kill in order to impress my bae, um, because I really, I really can't. It, it is impossible, that dragon is too powerful, and, uh, it's, it's just not happening. I, I for some reason thought, keep thinking something's going to happen if I go into my quarters, but it hasn't been happening, so, uh, yeah. Anyway, so, um, I'm gonna go ahead and first things first, go over to the war room, see how things are going with my fam and all that, see what they're up to. And, uh, see if there are more missions I can send them to do. So, uh, let's check things out, shall we? Also, it's raining outside, and, uh, the weather does not seem to, uh, want to figure out whether it's gonna be cloudy or sunny. It, it can't decide, and I don't know why. Anyway, let's check things out in uh, Orlay, since we've sent all our missions there. Uh, all that glitters, what have we got? There was a bit of a fight at the mine, with bandits, apparently, and not even Darkspawn. I'm pleased to report that the Darkspawn were cut down with relative ease. We've set up an outpost and recruited locals to begin mining the gold once again. Indeed, I'm told they are more than happy to do so, now that they're being protected. We found some useful equipment in the bandit cache, and any effort to gather coin at Skyhold will now be much easier. Cullen. So we get a wide greatsword. Ooh, do you mind if I take that schematic? Uh, investigate the ancient laboratory? What have we got? The less said about that place, the better. It is done. The, I'm sorry, I thought she was talking here. The less said about that place, the better. It is done. The tools are enclosed. Let the sands have that place now. Fisher. So we get a Magister Ice Staff. So, uh... Okay, so the ancient laboratory is just gonna forever remain a mystery. And improving morale. A small shipment of books arrived earlier in the week, along with a periodical from Val Royer. It was unexpected, but sparked some interest. Diversions are few, and it's good to know there's still a world out there. Send our regards to the Lady Ambassador. Night Captain Ryland, and we get 60 influence. Alright, that's right, I'm influential due to the fact that I value education. Always and forever. Uh, let's see, yep. Uh, make contact in the Emerald Graves. Liberate in Place du Lyon. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... Head on over here, find the source of the dark spawn, because uh, we still have that to figure out, and uh, Malice is not working for some reason, so we'll take care of that. I'm uh, gonna go ahead and bring my boy Dorian, and I'm gonna bring Cassandra and Iron Bolt. Yeah, we're, we're gonna do that. Alright, people, we've got things to do. People to murder will actually dark spawn to murder, so they're not people. Um, anyway, we've got a lot of things to do, so, uh, let's go ahead and take care of this business, shall we? Alright, let's see now. Excuse me? Oh, I realize I don't have anything, um to keep me hydrated for a bit, so I'll take care of that while the, this is loading. Still loading? Are you kidding? <laughs> Weird. Uh, screen is also a bit of a mess. I mean, it kind of always is, and I don't know what to do about it. <sighs> Just whenever you're ready, game, 
I'm waiting. Also kind of forgot to take my uh, pill this morning, so uh, I'll deal with that. The Western Approach, Death Drink Springs. Okay, so we are there. I'll be ready in just a moment, so I apologize. By the way, notice you two have got some nice longbows. Very glad that uh, you are taking up the good cause of being rangers. Excellent, both of you. Proud of you, and uh, oh, probably time to put those skills to good use. Okay, everybody good? Good. Touch Phoenix scales and Phoenix Light. Oh, I keep forgetting I need to bring that stuff over to, uh, to, uh, the research table. And did I hand in that quest for, uh, one of my, uh, teachers? I don't think I did. Anyway, um, let's head over to this place now and... Is that my phone? Hmm. I felt vibrating and I thought it was my phone. Weird. And... Okay, moving on. What do can we find up here? Oh, we can find a glowy skull up there. Always important and always means good things. Old prison road. Was this a prison place area? I mean, I could definitely see why it would be, but you know, wasn't quite expecting it. All right, what can we find? Mm, there's one. Should be a second one, not a third one this time, which is strange, but okay. And two. Oh, there was one over at the Griffin Keep again, and I had to travel all the way over here just to know about that. <sighs> you put me through so much trouble for no reason except for your own amusement game. What in the hell? Anyway, it seems like some hostiles up ahead. Don't mind if we go ahead and take care of that now. Uh, they, they, they seem a bit healthy there, though. Uh, how do they have so many? Please, little Fennec, move out. Uh, damn it! I, why did it have to? Why did it have to be in my shot? Just why? Ultimate archer technique. Why are you guys so... Uh, I, I, okay, that confused me a bit. Okay, that one's dead. Died instantly. Okay, that one just got up some extra armor shields. A little explosion won't take care of. And ultimate archer technique. There we go. He's asleep. And also on fire from explosions. And also Dorian's flames. Suppose you could say he's really on fire. My puns are amazing. Anyway, I'm taking those ghoul sores. I ain't taking your basic bitch crap. I mean, come on. What do you think I am? Some peasant? I am the Grand Holy Imperial Inquisitor of the Holy Imperial uh, uh, Beautiful Graceful Elven Empire here. It's Alfheim Empire, I mean. Alfheim. Very important that I put that that, that distinction. Because Elvin is nice, but all time, you know, has that flair to it. Okay, he did. No, 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 no. Don't shoot the innocent Fennec. I want you to shoot the dark spawn, not the Fennec. Jeez, Esthenor. Tell him. Kill that one. No armor shields for you. That is very rude of you. Ultimate archer technique, go. There we go. Yeah, you don't get to run away that easily. He's fine. He's got this. Come on. Come on. If he needed any help, I have my hands ready to massage that touch of his. 
there we go. All taken care of. I'll take that. And nothing to loot from you, it looks like. Okay. Now, where does this path lead us to? I'm curious. Oh, there's an Asterium. And it looks like we found the source of the dark spawn as well as a place to camp. Oh, very intriguing. We just have to kill all these dark spawns that are just in the way. Prison ruins, three more regions I need to discover, and then we've got the whole place scouted out. Alright, let's see now. What have we got up here? stuff to climb up here. Any secrets up here? Or... Oh, it seems like I missed a few. Or are they on the next level? They might be. Yeah, they, they might be after I climb this ladder. I have no idea, honestly. <laughs> Or maybe they're just the ladders and I'm just, I don't know, being an idiot. Now what do we have over here? Nothing, just, just some random camp. There's the Asteria though. And also some crafting materials I can take, so I don't mind if I have myself to them as well. Take you. Oops. And, uh, then I'm gonna go over here, take you, a lot of lazarite over here, so don't mind if I do. Alright, now we can continue on with the Asterium. See what challenge the gods have set before me. Alright, what have we got here? Okay, um, it does seem a bit challenging, I will admit. Uh, okay, so, and for some reason the mouse is just being a prick again. Um, okay, where to start exactly? How about... How about we start here? Like so. Oh wait, right, I can't travel that way. Um, oh wait, I think I got it. And like this, and there we go. Oh, it's a wolfie! I like it, I like wolfies. Oh, oh my. The constellation of Fingrir. Called White Wolf in common parlance, you ignoranus fox! This is not just a mere white wolf, you commoner peasants! Also, Fingrir isn't even white. I mean, come on, get your lore right. Fingrir has always been considered an oddity among scholars. Primarily because wolves have no special place with an ancient Tevinter folklore. Excuse me? You Tevinter bitches dare to not have the wolves be seen as important. How dare you? Just. How dare you? To many, this represents the strongest argument that the Imperium deliberately supplanted older elven constellation names. Oh, motherfuckers! <sighs> okay, okay, but let's just continue on. In the case of Fenrir, an alignment with the elven trickster god, Fenharel, would be logical. Others claim a much older Neromanian tale of a wolf escaping hunters by fleeing into the sky exists, but the legend's veracity has never been proven. From a study of Theodosian astronomy by Sister Oran Petar Petrakius, that is a very difficult name to pronounce. Oh, there's one over there now. 
Well, that's two of the Asterians out of three taken care of in this place, so, uh, we're making good progress here, I would say. Now, what's in this building? Oh, this is to a new location. Well, obviously we need to investigate, so don't mind if we do. Try experiencing the Inquisition again with a different world history. Design your world at uh, Dragon Cage Keep. Yeah, I uh, I did kind of set that whole thing up originally, but then I realized uh, it kind of would require me to start the game over, so uh, I'm just sticking with this, what I have here a little bit. Stay on guard. Well, we do have some dark spawn nearby already, so... Uh, oh, and some dead bodies. Oh, and some loot. Don't mind if I take care of that. Uh, gold, ruby, shadow hunter bow. Well, I can sell this. Everything else stays, though. Uh, anything else other than that thing I do not care about? Aha! Well, since you're all in one place now, may as well blow you up. There we go. All taken care of. Enhanced I'm guessing there's more. The darkspawn will have the run of this place. Good. Uh, I'm just getting warmed up. Well, Dorian's fire is probably helping with that if we're being perfectly honest. Uh, discovered holding cells. So basically what we are seeing here is that the uh, darkspawn have taken over a prison camp. That can only mean terrible things, and these doors seem similar to the ones I couldn't open back in the Western Approach. There better be a key to that, then. Uh, ancient Aventor bracelet used to brand and number prisoners. Tooth-shaped gem. I'm surprised Dorian doesn't have anything to say about this, since this literally talks about something of his people's involvement. Or something along those lines. Sores. Definitely should uh, get an advantage in dealing with ghouls and dark spawn at some point. Enhanced ring of guard penetration. And anything else? Okay, well, there are some bodies still looting this prison. Um, did, did I loot it or what, what happened? Oh, no, no. No, it was focusing on energizing rather than looting this corpse. Does it not know me? Lardis Slave Band. A ring designed to be permanently affixed to the finger of a living slave belonging to House Lardis. Still nothing, Dorian? Alright, what's this gonna show? Alright, Dorian and me. Uh, Veilfire now. What this is going to be for, I have no idea. But it's for something, probably. Maybe, no idea, but we'll see. Something to read. Blood spattered note. The giants are half feral. There's no room for a weak hand. One is enough to move debris during excavation, but keep it under control. We don't need the whole building coming down. So well, they were using the giant as a beast of burden. I guess so. The Secret Tongue of Slaves. Despite widespread illiteracy, Tevinter slaves have developed a series of small pictograms that they scrawl on walls or under furniture, hidden from uncaring owners. Regional variations make deciphering them a unique challenge. In one city, the sign of a clenched fist means a murderous master. In another, the same symbol indicates a harsh slave owner, but not one with a fatal temper. Oh, the ruling class's general indifference to the moods and fears of their slaves makes this pictorial argot an important method of communication. It is therefore all the more strange so many Tevinter comedies center around farcical misunderstandings of a sloppily written sigil, where witty slaves scramble to subvert blame in time to avoid beheading. Perhaps it comforts Tevinter's well-to-do to believe that their property is only this clever and human in fiction. From a lesson book by Besha of Ravain. Hmm. Does that mean uh, we will eventually come across? Is are these pic 
the pictograms of the slaves or huh I wonder if we'll be coming across those and they are revealed by the uh, veil fire maybe it's a possibility where would I be able to find them though oh I did did I loot that already, or... Okay, well, it had nothing of value anyway. Hmm. Where would I look for it? Nope, not there. Already loot that, I know. Just kind of want to be sure. Uh, oh, well, there it is. That's why you look. Spirit rune. Huh. Alright, well, I wonder where. what else I might just find. Uh, with the, uh, Veil Fire in this place. Hmm. Guards Hall. Yeah, I think it was this way. I didn't progress past, uh, there is someone impaled on a bunch of stakes, it looks. Interesting. Up, oh, enemies. Or enemy. Good thing Dorian didn't need to put down the, uh, the veil fire, that is, if it was needed, or anything, a uh, burning fire of corpses, it looks. So I'm guessing this is exactly how the prison, uh, fell apart, was because they dug too deep, kind of like an Orzammar, and ran into Darkspawn and hook. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and take five, get a little bit of region, uh, There we go. I should be fine soon. Taken care of. Locate those responsible. Seal the tunnel before more darkspawn join us. Yeah, sounds like a good idea. Stop the darkspawn. These anyway. I imagine there are a million more still underground. The tunnel was open from the outside. Someone was digging here. Yeah, so we're gonna have to locate those responsible, as the mission suggests. And, uh, I kind of get the feeling that most of them are probably dead. Vandal Aria. Hmm. Unlocked a new codex. How nice. Now, where might we find those responsible if they haven't already been killed down here? Well, I guess, uh, the mission says somewhere around here. That herlock will put up a fight. Stand ready. Well, I mean, we kind of already know that, Cassandra, but yeah, you're right. No, don't try and hit me. That'd be rude, sir. And yo, stop trying to shoot me. That's my job. Only I get to shoot me. And I'm not into that. Thank you very much. But thank you for that. Dorian still is just like, yeah, I'm on my, uh, I'm holding the veil fire. Don't worry about it. I, I still got this under control. Oh, darn you. Oh, well, if we do happen to find any runes, however, we, we'll be able to, we'll be able to take care of that. And, uh, yo, die. How, how do you have so much health there, Darkspawn Archer? You're an archer. You're not supposed to be tanky and healthy. Come on. That's not how it works. Anyway, um, I kind of want to investigate everything area though, so I want to make sure I get absolutely everything. Oh, I can unlock this. Now, what might we have in this room? Ancient list of prisoners. This crumbling parchment predates the second blight. Emil Valen, uh, thievery. Eunia Talvas, inciting dissidents to be kept in isolation. Gallus, property of House Lartis, conspiring to commit treason, given over for further interrogation. Well, so that explains that part. Siscara Atrius, concealing a fugitive with full knowledge of his crimes. Quint Nevera, uh, Qu uh, Quintin Navar, public indecency. Sentencing of all criminals to commence three days hence upon the return of the Praetor. Seriously, they kept him in a place, it, it, all together in the same place for varying crimes? Freed are the slaves. We found another mosaic piece, though. Like, seriously? You thought, eh, let's put a random thief and 
someone for public indecency on the same level for treason and uh, dissidence. That just kind of seems confusing. I don't get it, honestly. But, one nation army is battle mage armor, I don't care. Anything else? Doesn't seem like it so far. Oh, did I already loot that, or... Oh, no, I did not. Otherwise, I would have taken everything in that. Oh, wait, did I check that side of this bridge? Okay, yeah, something to loot over there. Miniature mask. Uh, basic bitch stuff. Uh, something to read. A missing slave. In Tevinter, a slave is invisible. Even though the entire empire rests on our backs, our hands built the walls of Minrathos and carry its wealth along the crumbling roads. Scribes like myself take dictation and write letters that shift the balance of power. My daughter, Leonora, a kitchen slave, works nine days so Magister Delphine isn't troubled by a torn robe or a cold supper. Normally, I meet Leonora about the kitchens, but it has been days since our paths cross. No one has seen her. I can't help but think of the old stories that cross the slave markets like lightning. How centuries ago, the ancients built their cities with blood magic, raising the very towers and walls with terrible rituals using our lives as fuel. Thousands of slaves were sacrificed as we were forced onto the altars of the old gods. Magister Delphine's perfect marble-faced mansion likely stands on the back of hundreds of voiceless elves. But that was a different time. Andraste's words against blood magic made the practice all but forbidden and shunned. Though we may be punished, few slaves are dragged to the altar or milked of blood without at least some reprimand. Yet Leonora is missing, and Magister Delphine seems different. She carries an aura she never had before, and rumors fly that a bitter rival has been publicly humiliated in a duel of magic. Through my grief, I fear, I know that my Leonora's life was the price. I ache to speak as an equal with Magister Delphine to demand answers, but such an audience would be a joke to her. No one sees a slave. Written in secret by slave scribes Solvar and Bran, 865 Blessed. Solvar and Bran. Hmm. Faded interrogation notes. The faded ink of this parchment suggests it is from a prison's records. Let none be so foolish as to deny the power of born, the power born of affection. Mark my words for death would only bear a martyr. Persuade Talvas to speak the truth. Permit that honey tongue to undo its own mischief. They think to question the Archon's authority to deny his reach. Will they do so once they, their beloved Eunia sings the magistrate's praises? Should Talvas prove unreasonable, remove her teeth? One wonders how much charm she will wield without a handsome smile. That is terrifying. Anyway, back to what we were doing before. Let's go ahead and uh, head on over here. What was that? Something we should probably be a little bit concerned about. Just a little though. I got you, Bay. Damn. Apparently it was so good that it had to freeze time just for that shot. <laughs> anyway, um, let's continue on. Question is, uh, is that the giant we probably have heard of in words in that writing earlier? Wrapped prison key. A crumpled note. Track down service in the western approach. There was nothing to indicate this place was built over an old deep roads entrance while the complications uh, of, uh, bleh. while the complications with Darkspawn were unfortunate we've dealt with the pack that emerged and I will hear no further talk of it we have enough to secure the south dig site you will continue work in the corridors and you will do so without complaint alternatively we could use you as a distraction should more Darkspawn hinder our efforts you serve Corypheus either way service Venatori They've been excavating. I take it breaking into Darkspawn tunnels wasn't part of the plan. 
They'll be holed up somewhere if the dark spawn didn't get them. Oh yes, and once we do get to them, we're definitely gonna have to ask a few questions. Huh. For some reason I thought there was uh there was something I could investigate. My bad. <laughs> this place gets better and better. You better, you better just have thoughts about it as we are fighting this giant right now. No! Why me specifically? Alright, for that ultimate archer technique. Oh, did you not like that gun at your feet? Well, too bad. I'm just gonna go ahead and continue blowing up your kneecaps. Actually, isn't all that tough. Yeah, I think about it. There we go. He dead. Vince Darkspawn, a giant. This was a pretty good day. Oh, and then here I were neighbors. Someone must have been coordinating their efforts. I doubt they stuck around to fend off Darkspawn. Would probably have to agree on that point. So uh, now that we have been able to take care of that giant, what else can we find here? Venatory plans. You'll do well to muzzle your doubt. Our information was passed down to Lucanus uh, uh, from Corypheus's most trusted servants. Be grateful you were chosen to come at all. Think of the power locked in these wastes. We need only to find it. Once liberated, we shall never rely on tinctures of lyrium or crude blood work again. Is that not worth any risk? To become a little godlike ourselves? Tell me the thought holds no appeal. We must exhaust every lead, however faint it may be. To do less is to dishonor him. I must check our progress at Echoback Fort. I expect a full progress report upon my return. Service. Yeah, we're really gonna have to figure out who this service guy is. Alright, something to loot over there. Snake Vitar. Okay, yeah, that I know I can loot. Just want to investigate uh, from dual blade grip. Definitely quite a lot happened here, without a doubt. Superior Hunter Mail. This seems interesting. Perhaps maybe it'd be a nice new look for me. What's their approach? South exit. Now, where might this lead us to? The new camp area. Well, don't mind if I go ahead and set everything up. Hmm, okay then. Now, let's see. Oh, so this was the place we couldn't access before. I gotcha, okay. Wait, what's this? Shards in the approach. Oh, right, yeah, there was uh, that area as well and uh, another shard over there. Okay. Gain some power from it, of course. Excellent. Take this box to loot. Inquisition scout hat and have stamina. Wait, why do we have our weapons out? Interesting. Something to loot over here, it looks like, as well. Topaz, Ring of Staggering. What's over here? Oh, some Lazarite. Oh, and another shiny skull. Don't mind if I go ahead and take a closer look, while also, uh, More giants! What are they, pits? The Vins are crazier than I thought. Yeah, it kinda seems like it, and, uh, we're gonna have to take care of that, it looks. Do a backflip! No, no, 
no, no, no, no, no, no, no, no, don't you dare throw that at me. How did you even know I was there? I was invisible! Well, I'm just going to have to put you down there, mister. You do not get to see me when I was... Well, um, clearly you have some strange powers there, sir, so please die. Now. Now, uh, okay, uh, now, anytime, you are very low health and you are about to die. Seriously, how are you not dead yet? Okay, that was good. I'm gonna have to put this one down, too. There we go. Perfect. Okay, now to take all the loot and... Uh, why do you buy all these basic bitch stuff? Seriously, why? Our guys, scales. Don't mind if I do. Okay, now that we've taken care of that giant problem, let's, uh... Shall we continue onward? Pro possibly, maybe? Yeah, I think that's a good idea. I actually intended to deal with the rift that was next to the camp, but, uh, oh well, it, this is leading me to more quest stuff, so don't mind if I do. Oh, well, there's a rift. May as well go deal with that. Really? There we go. Much better. You up. And you're dead. Alright, what more you got for me, Rifty? Dead. Uh, you did not blow up like I thought you would, but, uh, oh well. Dead. Exploded. And... Dead. Gonna close you up now. Perfect. That's another ref taken care of. All in a day's work. Frost Essence and uh, Pommel Strike. Rips and Echo back. Well, we took care of one of them. Oh, now what is... Hmm. Interesting. Got a glowy skull thing to take care of, though. Oh, clean quarry. Don't mind if I do. Perfect. Now we can go ahead and uh, make more progress on that tower. Now, what secrets can you show to me? Is, is that the place I literally came from? Actually, probably not. It. That's probably the place I literally came from. God damn it. Wait. Dark spawn, it looks like. And where might that last one be? Come on, don't be shy. Oh, there you are. That's all of them. Okay, then. So, yeah, they seem to be a bit of a distance away. Oh! We do have Cassandra's qu uh, quest over here to do, so uh, let's go ahead and help her out a little, shall we? Uh. You there! I have things to do for Cassandra's approval. Surrender now we have and. To stop this mate. Yeah, I don't think the warrior is the one you should really be worrying about at this point, although they are pretty good. Sad that it came to this, but at least it is done. Well, I'm glad. So that's two of the five targets eliminated. Take down Jepler and Emerald Graves. They're in a lot of places, it looks like. So, okay, they have a lot of silk with them, it looks. Cassandra greatly approves, and Cassandra approves. Excellent! Always nice to get my inner circle's approval. Now, let's see. I want to go ahead and claim this landmark. Oh, 
I'm gonna have to go down here so that I don't take some huge ass fall damage. Gates of Toth. Now then, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and claim you. This gate is carved with symbols of Toth, the old god of fire. It can only be opened by some kind of mechanism. Well, I still can't open the door, it looks like. But I'm on the other side of it, so like, why does it matter? I already have a camp set up and on this side, so like, I wanna go over here, I literally can. So there's nothing they could actually do to stop me. Now, I believe, I believe there was a shard over this direction. We just gotta kill these bar guys first. And apparently they really do not like fire, despite living in a desert. But then again, not many things really like dealing with fire. And excuse me. How close there, sir. Or ma'am. I honestly don't know, and I shouldn't have assumed. Okay, you're very low on health, so like, uh, just die already. And it's time now. Okay. I'll take a care of My guy scales. I'll take that. And there seems to be some hostiles that way, so let's take care of them too. Oh, you think you can do some magic there, sir? Well, too bad. Didn't happen. Also, you suck at assassinating because you missed me while you were invisible. What the fuck, man? Thought you were supposed to be good as an assassin, but apparently you suck. Shock. Okay, I, I do see you there. There we go. Take care of some hostiles. I wonder what they have over here. Oh, are they still fighting? Oh, no, they finished. Iron Bolt slightly approves. Excellent. Okay, so they don't really have anything. That camp had absolutely nothing except to point out that there were some Venatori camping there. Discovered Echo Back Fort. Sounds like a shard up there. There's also a shard over this direction, so we should probably take care of that first. Okay, and there you are, my precious. Come to Mama. Meet your new goddess. Alright, the spirit calm, the eye can unlock that next door, but I want all the shards in this area before I start uh, ex uh, investigating that temple further. Okay, so that's an exit out of here. Echo back fort. I wonder if I could claim this place. Well, if I can, gotta kill everyone first. Do you hide behind those stairs, sir? That's extremely rude, you ought to know, and you... How dare you? Think you could do better than me. Ow. Well, I'm just gonna blow the both of you up there. How does that sound? Seems like the big guy with the uh, giant axe is uh, coming up there, so uh, don't mind if I go ahead and shoot him down. And he has all that armor up. I mean, you can shout all you want, it's not gonna prevent you from dying. Like that, and exploding into ice, the apparently. will not easily recover now. It should make our own hold on the region stronger. I agree. Oh, there's a secret. I must investigate. Oh, must be uh, beneath this area. Did you guys, did you guys continue killing without me? Sorry, I didn't pay attention to that part. I I got distracted by secrets and blizzards, past master corrupting rune, and a bunch of gold. Don't mind if I take all of it. All right, let's see now. Where might that rune be? Did did we kill that guy already? Oh, take mosaic piece. The Ark Demon. We're making quite a bit of progress uh, with the uh, with uh, the mosaic pieces. It looks glad about that. <laughs> All right, and uh, let's go ahead and control Dorian for a little bit. Uh, that means nothing. 
vial of arc demon blood. I think Blackwall would have liked to have been here for this. Oh crap. Sorry. Sorry, Blackwall. Once again, I didn't bring you along. Now, uh, it says he should be here, but I don't see him. The trouble with Darkspawn. So that's the quest should be, like, right here. So, uh, I, I'm, I, I guess there's something I'm not understanding, I suppose. There is a shard over here, so I'm gonna need that. Oh, and there's also stuff to loot. Don't mind if I do. Well, none of it's worth anything, though. There you are. I'll take that. Five more left. Oh, and there's a landmark I can make, so uh, better go ahead and... Oh, and an Asterium. I'm also gonna need to deal with that as well. Let's see now. Oh, there's a cave in here. I see ya. Doran, please tell me you still have that... Excellent, you do. Okay. Let's check it out now, shall we? Master Frost Rune. Okay. Excellent work. Now, what do we have this way? This should lead me to where I'm supposed to go, I think. Echo Back Canyon, Miniature Throne, I'll take that, and... Oh! It leads me to the Asterium, I guess. I suppose that's something, but not quite what I had in mind. Okay. This seems, uh, a bit complex. I think I know what to do, though, maybe. doing. Um, okay. Let's, um, instead go this way. Like so. Um. I don't think I did this right either. Uh, no. I did not. I'm missing this part. Um, okay, how about here? We connect this area together. Mm. Then... Go like so... doesn't work either, because... Mm. Okay, no, that, that obviously did not work either. Hmm... Satinalis, uh, referred to as either Satina after the moon or as Satinalia after the holiday. In common parlance, the constellation Satinalis has always been depicted by the celebrant, a seated man playing a lyre. It should be noted that in ancient Tevinter, the constellation was known as Mortimalis and was represented by a warrior holding aloft a head. 
usually that of an elf. <sighs> the movement to officially rename it took hold in the Divine Age, and after 800 years, the original is all but forgotten. From a study of Theodosian astronomy by Sister Oran Petrarchius. Oh, I learned something new. And there's the cave that they lead me to. Okay, then. Well, I finished all the asterisks. Every one of these madmen we kill is one less who gets to return home. Warms my bitter little heart. <laughs> oh, Dorian, you just know me so well, and you and I share so much. Let's see. Mentor led by service were excavating in uh, into dark spawn infested tunnels. Service had since left the vicinity. Hmm. And yet I can't find what I'm supposed to be looking for anywhere. Or is it just somewhere deeper that I have no the idea? The Venatory will not easily recover now. It should make... You kind of already said that. Um, I have no idea why I'm not able to find the things that it tells me are in that location. A bit odd. Is there, like, supposed to be some other different way that I don't know about, or what? Well, we're gonna have to kill the Scar guys first. Back left. Okay, how did that hit me? And why were you targeting me specifically? Was there a reason to target me specifically? Have a fire mind, you little bitch. Yeah. Not so fun, is it? Oh, I literally have to stand still to do my basic attacks? Yeah, probably a good thing I didn't uh, try out mage necessarily. Anyway, now with that taken care of, let's uh, continue onward, shall we? Okay, yeah, there is something I didn't catch the first time. It was this little area as well, it looks. That means absolutely nothing. Okay, so never mind. I, that Once again, I was just being stupid. Okay, this is just odd. Not entirely sure how to explain that. Like, there's a landmark, and then there's also trouble with the dark spawn. What am I missing? Like, really, what am I missing? I have no idea. Oh well, there's some there's some mission stuff over this way, so I'll take care of those, and then figure out what the issue is. All right, this is where I killed the giant. And, uh, let's see. Shards in the approach. Yep. Better go find those. Let's see. Should be up here, I think. As well as the rift. Perfect. Why did you shoot in the sand? You were aiming for that one earlier, and you shot in the sand, Esthenor. What the hell? Where do you think you're going there? I don't think I don't see you. Give a regular healing potion. Ow. Take care of you. And you. Fair demon bitch with a fucking twirling. Come on, just die already, bitch. There we go. And Close you up. taken care of. Got the refs in the echo back. Perfect. Now to find that shard over here. Oh, there it is. I'll be taking that. Alright, so now we just need to find four more. We've got them all. 
now I just need to head back to the fort and see if I could figure something out. Can I just... I cannot just travel back to the, uh, the fort. Ugh, fine, I see how it is. Have to make me walk everywhere. As if I don't deal with that enough. Like, is it not bad enough that I literally have to walk everywhere in the desert in this hot, blazing sun? Quite unreasonable, I would say. Truly. Alright, what landmark exactly am I missing? Okay, there's a lazarite. But not where the landmark is. Okay, back to full health, and everything is fine now. Now to figure out where that mission is and that landmark, because I definitely want the landmark. Just like I want that last landmark over in the Forbidden Oasis that I can't figure out how to reach. Because Every I... one of these madmen we kill is one less who gets to return home. Warms my bitter little heart. You said that already, actually, so, uh... Uh, why why are my companions repeating their lines? Except for, uh, except obviously for Iron Bull. He's the only one that hasn't repeated his lines. What am I missing about this place? It says it's right here. But I have no idea where it is. This has uh, nothing, really. This only had the veil fire. And this, I remember, didn't have much value. And uh, nope, no landmark. Hmm. I am very confused. I'm not the only one confused by this, right? Uh, oh, their service, what? He was still alive! Still breathing. He's resilient, I'll give him that. Hmm, I'm gonna go ahead and take him in alive for judgment. Have some of the troops bring him in. I'll deal with him back at Skyhold. Okay, there we go. Mission accomplished. I mean, after all, I have a few questions I need to ask you. The last step. A fragment of an inscription remains on one of the stones. It reads, last step of civilization before the abyss. Alright. Got three power for that. And, uh, do I have all the landmarks? Oh, there's something mysterious over that way that I... Somehow didn't quite get, even though I was right there. Weird. But okay. Um. Well, I mean, I kind of have to investigate that now. Probably be the last thing I do before I, uh, head back to Skyhold and, uh, judge service. Uh, oh, something to read. Elegantly written letter. Magister Nantarius, Verantium Office of the Praetor. Dear Madam. I've been informed that you are looking for an experienced administrator to organize your lead mining enterprises in four kingdoms. I humbly present myself as a candidate for the vacancy. I have extensive experience as the overseer of multiple archaeological digs in the Western Approach, and have successfully managed several mercenary army ventures simultaneously. At present, I am seeking new employment opportunities in less arid climates and as far as possible from the Inquisition. Please see my attached resume for further in, uh, credentials. Yours, Crassius Service. Hmm. Interesting. So he was trying to find a place away from me. Eh, I suppose it makes sense. He probably knew I was going to come for him eventually. But he should have known he cannot escape me. He should have always known. Anyway, let's go ahead and take care of this bunch of hostiles blow them all up as well while we're at it. We are just not able to figure out who it is we're fighting. Gonna blow the both of you up there. And we're the only ones to come out alive, obviously. Our guy scales. Iron Bull slightly approves, Dark and Samite, but everyone knows that Iron Bull's approval is always the most valuable of treasures. 
Now then. Am I heading further away from the place I wanted to go to? Oh, wait, hold on. Not what I wanted to do, but I guess the uh, question mark is gone now, so that does mean I can go ahead and uh, teleport myself somewhere else. Those are a couple of the shards. Um, what's this? Asterium's in the approach. Oh, that's where the cave is. Well, may as well figure out what that's about. See what treasures await us in that location after all the hard work of uh, putting together those constellations for the Asteriums. And may as well ask. I've new, sir. Report. What is it? Could prove useful, sir. Okay, yep, I could go ahead and hand that requisition in. So, uh, don't mind if I give myself more power. Several dwarven academics at the University of Orlea have requested samples of ore from the Western Approach. Excellent. Alright, let's see. Uh, I have facing in the wrong direction. Should be somewhere over here. Maybe? Oh no, wait. I passed right by it. Beneath me, or what? Oh, okay. What's in there? Something important, I would say. Doran, if you would do the honors, it, um, what? what? <laughs> All right, veil fire. Don't mind if I take some. Now, what treasures await me in here? Light overlook. Well, I definitely could say it's been overlooked. No, nothing. Uh, Lazarite, anyways, I'll take some of that. Another thingy to activate. Again, I have no idea what these things do. They give me influence, though. And, uh, a rune, okay. Don't know what rune it was that I unlocked, because it didn't say. Uh, oh, Master Fire Rune. Okay, perfect. Way better than the fire runes I've been using, I assume. And, ooh, mosaic piece. Uh, the Arc Demon. Soon enough, I'll be able to put all the pieces together for these mosaics eventually, maybe. It's just gonna take a lot of effort to, uh, to get them all, it's, uh, it seems. Okay, I think that's everything in here. Oh wait, I missed something. Looks like Lazarite though, it is. Take that though, may as well. Uh, looks like everything. All right, was there another path I could have taken or something? Uh, okay, nope, there is uh, no path over there. Wait, what did I just see over there? My eyes just wanted to look for things. It probably was Iron Bull's axe, probably, now that I think about it. Oh! Now, what might have been this way? Or is it just blocked off? Uh. Nah, it, it, it's just there for, for reasons. Anyway, that looks like everything in this area. Although that apparently was not the thing I was looking for? Hmm. I guess I just came across that by accident. Oh well. Glad I did. Um, is it over here? It could be. Maybe. Bit of a stretch it. No, it is not. I was wrong. Never mind. Even with the Asterium's help, it's difficult finding them, it looks like. Am I still in the uh, range of the... Okay, I am. Couple of death roots. Hmm. Where are you, mysterious cave? I 
don't know why I'm pressing this to find it. I, I'm pretty sure it doesn't help me find the cave. I don't know what other gate it's trying to have me look, uh, or cave it's trying to have me look for, because that seemed difficult enough to find. I would have assumed that would be the cave it want me to find, but I guess it wasn't. Weird. Cassandra, can you? Okay, thank you. I'm surprised it wasn't. Seriously, how is that not what I was supposed to look for? It's so confusing. want me to find. Eh, oh well. I don't necessarily have the time for it. I have someone that I need to judge, so I'll figure that out at another time. Uh, for now, um, let's get back to Skyhold and make our judgments, and oh yeah, we're gonna have to give the uh, artifact to Blackwall, and he's gonna be He's going to be upset that we didn't bring him along for this one particular artifact. <sighs> That's going to be a little bit annoying, if I'm being perfectly honest. Just that he's going to guilt trip me a little. Just because he wasn't there. I'm sorry I didn't bring you along to see that one artifact, but I brought you along to see all the others, so maybe I'll just go ahead and hand it to him in case there's another cutscene with him. And then I will make my judgment upon service. My great, valuable, and justified judgment upon him. Anyway, did I talk to Three Eyes already? Place to save lives. What could be more important? Oh, right, yeah, we did also have the courtyard. It was a demon, they say. It wasn't. Disease, maybe. Uh, we had the courtyard work as an infirmary, and hey, Blackwell, how you doing? Heard you found something that had to do with wardens. I did. Would have liked to have seen it. <sighs> Let's see. Um... I want to hear more about you. <laughs> Compared to yours, my life will seem dull indeed. Uh, where are you from? Your name, Blackwall, doesn't sound Orlesian. Marcher, then? Ferelden? I was from the Free Marchers originally. Markham. That was a long time ago. Another life. So we have a past. I hear that many Wardens were once criminals. You're right. And when you join, your past is forgotten, so let's leave it that way. Oh, okay. You weren't always a Warden? What did you do before you became a Warden? I was... A soldier, a, a nobody trained to wield a sword and follow orders. I grew weary of fighting other men's wars. So you became a warden? More or less. Becoming a Grey Warden was the first time I felt like I mattered. Hmm. The life I led before seems hollow in comparison. Perhaps one day it will fade away. Why'd you become a warden? Why did you join the wardens? Because they remember honor and sacrifice words that have little meaning to the rest of us because they lay down their lives for those they have sworn to protect we all need to believe there are such men in the world i needed to believe i could be one of them we can continue this discussion at another time very well okay now all we have left is uh and please do your own artifacts and oops tables right um i want to change my um mount uh let's see are they a drag uh Hunter Shade Dracolisk. Ooh. Seems badass. Rarely seen the Hunter Shade is hardy and powerful. It requires a disciplined rider to take advantage of its skittish nature. You don't mind if I do? I'm the perfect Our candidate. Have never had better. Oh, aren't you just precious, aren't you? Who's a good Dracol as you are? Yes, you are. Just wanna I just wanna grab your cheeks and love you. Anyway, uh, let's see. Kim, three eyes. There you are. You have your tools. The first of the pieces that you could build with. You've a choice. Do you commit to constructing yourself? Making? There's no splitting focus. 
No splitting focus? Well, I, I guess I can't necessarily do all Not yet. I'll come back to this. I may have, uh, I may have completed your task, but, uh, I think I'm more dedicated to the assassin thing, sort of. Uh, so, yeah, I'm... If I do have to commit to one over the other, I, I guess, uh, I can't hand in the quest. Anyway, um... I'm gonna go ahead and head to my, uh, judgment chambers, or my judgment throne, actually. And then, uh, yeah, we'll continue from there. Alright, service! Before my beautiful, my beautiful mighty court! In the Holy Elven Imperial Inquisition of Alfheim, it is time for your judgment to be made. Before you is Servus of the Minrathus Circle of Magi. You met him and his venatory in the Western Approach. I do remember that. He admits to working for Corypheus, raising monsters and using magic for conquest. He also used his connections to smuggle magical artifacts out of the approach, without his master's consent. Hmm. I'm actually quite impressed. You stole from Corypheus. I don't know whether that's stupidly brave or bravely stupid. <laughs> I was hired by a third party. I've no loyalty to him. Might you find that useful, Your Worship? I'm sorry, are you attempting to bargain with us? Bargain? I plead. I throw myself on your mercy. I also have friends in Tavinta who owe me large debts. Hmm. Leave what happened in the approach behind us, Inquisitor, and I can put them all at your disposal. You have my attention. Give him back to Corypheus, throw him in jail, an informant on probation. If what you say is true, then perhaps I could make use of your talents. But I do expect full repayment on your bargain. Liliana will assign agents to you. I expect them to inform me that you have been forthright. If you want redemption, you'll have to earn it. I can more than pay my keep, Inquisitor. <laughs> Thank you. Good. Ooh, got approvals except for Sarah. But you know what? Who cares about Sarah's opinion? Oh, Cole disapproves, though. Vivian slightly approves. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Uh, Cole's the only opinion that, uh, didn't quite agree with me. And does matter. But Sarah's opinion, no. Nobody cares about her opinion. Uh, how long have I been recording exactly? Oh, a little bit over the time limit. So, uh, gonna have to be, uh, uh at my throne area. So that I can uh, go ahead and uh, just end the video. So I felt that was a good note to end things on. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Give that like button a stab if you did. Subscribe if you want more death in your life. Be sure the bell is tolling for the Anton time. Rest in peace. Bye! Enjoyed today's video? Well, there's plenty more for you to enjoy here. And if you also want to support this small channel, then there is also my Kofi, which is available, as well as a Twitter thread that gives you my commissioning info. And if you'd like some traditional art or literature, feel free to DM me on Twitter. Thank you for enjoying the video and for your viewership.